At tonight, police are trying to track down a sexual predator who molested an underage boy in a public restroom in Manhattan Beach. Investigators say it happened this afternoon at Pollywog Park. Police believe the same suspect may have molested another child earlier this week in Hermosa Beach. KCAL 9's Christine Lazar is live in Manhattan Beach with the details. Christine. Well, Juan, things are quiet now at this park, but the residents here sure are talking about this, and they're even more unnerved to learn that this might be a serial molester. For the poor little boy who went through what he did today, it just it breaks my heart. It truly breaks my heart. In the middle of the day when this Manhattan Beach Park is filled with children and families, police say a boy walked into this bathroom and was forced into a stall where a man groped him. One park employee tells us the victim was around four years old. I was horrified to hear it happened across the street from where we live. Jackie Nadeau got a text message alert from the police department shortly after the 2 p.m. attack. She has a seven-year-old daughter and brings her to the park every day. Catherine Chang has a 10-year-old son. I can't imagine um, if this happened to my little boy. And detectives believe this may not be an isolated attack. Just this past Wednesday, a 13-year-old boy was also grabbed by a man and molested in a stall in the public bathroom at Valley Park in Hermosa Beach, just two miles from the attack at Pollywog Park in Manhattan Beach. The suspect descriptions in both attacks are similar. Police in the neighboring cities have beefed up patrols at neighborhood parks with both marked and undercover officers. And I think the entire community will feel so much more comfortable once this monster is caught. And now uh, one witness who was at the park shortly after the attack tells me that they did see the little boy with his mother and she was noticeably upset, as you can imagine. Now, police are looking for the public's help. They say if you notice anything suspicious at any of these neighborhood parks, they want to hear from you. Live in Manhattan Beach, I'm Christine Lazar, KCAL 9 News. Okay, Chris